Amazingly, President Biden is warning Israel that allowing politicians to be involved in nominating judges is going to perhaps affect our shared democratic values. Where, of course, in America, politicians do exactly that. Eugene Kantorovich is a scholar of international law, an expert in the Israeli-Arab conflict, and a professor at George Washington University's Scalia School of Law. At a time when many have lost faith in international organizations, I sat down with them to discuss what role they should actually play. With all international institutions, the trade-off is how to be able to rely on them for small things and not put faith in them for important things. We also discuss the current protests in Israel, the U.S. State Department's role in supporting some of them, and whether judicial reforms proposed by Netanyahu's coalition are, in fact, a threat to democracy. In Israel, the court picks its own successes. So what you essentially have is the supreme power in the state is held by a self-selecting group of people completely insulated from any democratic process. This is American Thought Leaders, and I'm Yanya Kelleck.